Hey y'all, what's good everyone? Welcome to my channel. I am a Sage Who Rises. Today, I will be doing the Sun Moon Rising of Taurus. So let's get to it. So angels, what's the tea for Taurus at this time? So Taurus, I'm saying that you're having a new beginning. You're trying again. You're going in a new direction. And you're starting over. Yeah, but you got heart fog here. Somebody could be sending you mixed signals, and it's because they got some type of block emotions. This is a messed up individual. Yeah, somebody could be wanting to curse you with hex, witchcraft. They want you to have a negative mind. Yeah, and it's because they want a second chance to commit to you. They want to return because they're broken. They're heartbroken. They're destroyed. They're shattered without your ass. Let's just get that out there. <laughs> This could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, or Sag. And you could be independent, self-sufficient, a go-getter. You don't need a nigga or a bitch for anything. And somebody could be judging you. This could be somebody that's religious. They shame people using religion. And, um, yeah, a spiritual belt is needed. You got some type of dark energy surrounding you at this time. This could be with a bully, a coward. Yeah, this is somebody who doesn't have the balls to say what the fuck they got to say to your face. They got a nerd to be out here picking fights and talking shit about you, but scared to face your ass. <laughs> like, get the fuck out of here. So let's see what's going on. Why is beginning here? Try again. New direction. Why is this here? Yeah, you got a king of pentacles. This could be your energy. This could be a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. This person is watching you. And they're seeing you as a wish fulfillment. I have a swords in reverse. This is somebody that is having to admit defeat. You got a King of Cups in reverse. This could be a Scorpio with the Death card, Cancer, or a Pisces. This is definitely a masculine energy. They're trying to manipulate you. And they're trying to use the love that you have for them. And I see you letting their ass go. Standing ten toes in your power. Queen of Pentacles, listen to your intuition to walk away from people, places, and things that no longer serve you. And you're standing ten toes down on it, you know, going off of what you love to do. And somebody is mentally stuck in trap. Knight of Wands, because you out here following your passion. Why is heart fog here? Yeah, somebody is sending you mixed signals. With the Fool card, they want to have a new beginning with you. With the Three of Swords, they're heartbroken. Empress, Chariot. So somebody is heartbroken. When it comes to you, Empress, because you're overcoming obstacles, you have a brand new beginning here, and somebody feels way down. You also got a queen of swords, pan motherfuckers, and a group to be seen as self-sufficient, independent. This is what somebody did in the past when they came to a queen of cups because they wanted to take something from this person. Oh, you got a queen of cups that's wanting to give you something, but whatever they gave you, it's like... They're trying to take from you. With the Six of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles, it's like they're trying to take from you because they don't have something. Why is Curse here? Yeah, somebody is trying to hex you. Do witchcraft. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles. This could be a Virgo. They're doing this on a routine. You got a King of Cups here that um call they self following their passion. I'm saying that you left this person. You moved away from this person. Two of Cups. This definitely could have been somebody you was in the connection with. Ace of Swords. That's the truth. Two of Swords. That is a stalemate. Four of Cups. They missed the opportunity. Three of Pentacles. To work with you. Temperance and reconcile. To bring something into balance. Yeah. When they tried to witchcraft. When they tried to do witchcraft. When they tried to hex you. When they tried to like do something to cause you to have a negative mindset. Of course. <laughs> the fuck? Why a second chance here? Now somebody wants to reconcile. They want to make amends. They want an opportunity with you. Stock are, yeah. They want to heal. Nine of Cups, date you. Seven of Wands, but you blocked them. Eight of Cups, and walked away. High Priestess, use it to your intuition. Queen of Pentacles, to stand your ground and to let somebody go. Now they got to admit defeat. They got to admit defeat. Just period. I fucking will. Somebody is in their feelings because you got a new beginning with somebody else. All right, what we talking about? It's like, <laughs> this your life, you feel me? Why is fire sign here? 
Yeah, six of swords. You're moving away from this person. There could be like some healing going on, healing in progress when it comes to this person. You're moving on. You're moving to calmer waters. You could be escaping a fire sign. That's the truth. So that you can work on yourself. Because this relationship is incompatible. And you could have had a new beginning with them. You could have overcame some obstacles. You could have got victory and success. But this person could be in competition with somebody that's wanting to date you. And you could be leaving their ass out in the cold. Yeah, with the Queen of Wands, I'm saying that you're very strong, brave, fun, independent. And you're leaving somebody out in the cold who you once was dating. Because it's like they always trying to co cause conflict or battle you. And it's because of the attention you receive. Yeah, you overcoming obstacles after taking some type of action to have a brand new passionate beginning with somebody that you're incompatible with. It's like you did the work and you're getting truth and clarity that you need to move away from this person. Why is independent here? Again, you're so sufficient. A go-getter. You know, don't need a nigga or a bitch for shit. Yeah, sun card. That's a yes. That's a fucking yes. And again, a yes. You are not mentally stuck and trapped on somebody from your past. You've already learned this lesson. And you got a queen of cups, high priestess, that's crying over spilled milk. Because there was some type of magic done to like... Hold this person back. That's the truth. But I'm saying that somebody could have paid their lover to end something from them. Uh, see, what's so crazy here is. Somebody could have tried to end your independence. A couple. That's the truth. They paid somebody to try to like hold back your finances with magic. Now somebody is crying over spilled milk because you listen to your intuition about a queen of cups in the past. And you learned the lesson. Now this person is mentally stuck and trapped because they tried to take something from you. But soon when they did that, they got exposed. Yeah, with the star card, you've healed. Like I said, somebody could be judgmental, religious, and trying to shame people using religion. Why is this here? For Taurus. Yeah, with the seven of swords. Like, somebody is a fucking liar here. They're very obsessed here with trying to end something so they can end something with you and your lover. So it's looking like somebody could be judgmental to your choices. And they could be letting. They could be letting you go or you could be letting them go. Or somebody could be like judging your relationship and you could have let them go so that you can heal because you see them as toxic and a liar. Yeah, somebody took some type of action to like take something from you. Now they're mentally stuck and trapped. This is somebody who jumped on a bear wagon in the past, a queen of cups. Who you've already listened to your intuition about. Now this person is in loss, grief. Because they did some type of magic here to try to control a situation. Or they did magic to hold back your finances. Why a spiritual bath is needed? Dark energy surrounding you at this time. Yeah. Knight of Cups. This could be pertaining to somebody that you're dating. Yeah, this person is in competition with you. And you're about to realize that shit so that you can overcome some type of obstacle. With this Knight of Cups, it's like somebody that you're dating. You're being told to leave them out in the cold. You're showing up as the Queen of Wands. Somebody that's very energetic, strong, brave, independent, confident, outgoing, sexy. You know? And you're being told to listen to your dreams. Because something is being made a reality. You're about to get some type of truth or clarity. On why something didn't work out. And it's because of a misunderstanding. Or it's because somebody has insecurities. And they could be trying to cause imbalances to your wish fulfillments. Again. It's somebody's wish fulfillment was to cause you imbalances. Because they was insecure. I'm saying that somebody did not want to work with you. But the truth is being revealed. You just got to listen to your intuitive downloads or your dreams. Queen of Wands is feeling left out in the cold. This is somebody that's wanting to date you. But you've already overcome this obstacle with this attention seeker that do anything for attention. It's like somebody creates arguments.
conflict all for attention with the five of wands six of wands like weird pretty much like i don't know about dealing with somebody like that yeah death card page of cups i'm saying that you could be letting somebody go you're listening to your intuition what we got going on for toys yeah, nine of cups. Your wishes is being fulfilled. Somebody else missed the opportunity. We're trying to win at all costs. That's how they sabotage themselves. Now you get to move the calm waters. As something get laid to rest for them because you healed. And the will is turning in your favor. Somebody was so busy trying to compete with you over money, over a car. And now it's like they set their stuff back. With that Ace of Pentacles cherry, it's like five, we got the Five of Wands, Ace of Pentacles cherry. Somebody was so busy trying to compete with your bag, with your car, that they missed the opportunity. <laughs> Why is the Nine of Cups here? Yeah. I'm saying that your wishes is being fulfilled. You will be able to heal from some type of magic. And somebody else is going to have to walk away. Why is the Four of Cups here? Yeah, somebody missed the opportunity when you ghost their ass. Yeah, you ghosted somebody. King of Swords, that's the truth. Page of Wands, then you got good news coming. Ten of Cups towards your long-term wishes. A long-term relationship. Your happiness, joy, contentment. Why is the Five of Swords here? Yeah, somebody tried to win at all costs. They tried to bully you, intimidate you. Page of Pentacles, this is somebody who's a student, though. Ace of Swords, that's the truth. When you were innocent, so you're being seen as innocent. The truth is being exposed. That somebody was like investing and trying to defeat you, win at all costs, intimidate you, bully you, just to get victory and success. It's like whatever victory you thought they was going to get, that shit has been blocked. They're now powerless, mentally stuck and trapped. Why is the hang one here? Yeah, somebody sabotaged themselves. They're stuck. High priestess. So, yeah. You let go of somebody. You listen to your intuition about a masculine, and you stood your ground. Yeah, it's like you stood your ground against either a child's father, a father figure, a masculine. You listen to your intuition to let their ass go. And you got a king of cups here, Scorpio, Kiss, and Pisces. This person want to have a brand new passion to begin with you. But this person is heartbroken that you was able to balance out the energy with a king of wands and a queen of wands. So they've been plotting on you, trying to attack you. This could be a family member that's crying over spilled milk when it comes to like a mother figure. But that's their karma for working with a group of people. Why is the six of swords here? Yeah, you moving away from this trio that work together. It's a group of bitches that work together in the players to block you. None of they dumbass is powerless. Cause you are this badass being that's full with that's full with life, love, and possibilities. And somebody is about to go through a backfire. Cause you was just out here following your heart. Now you're getting victory and success. Queen of Swords, that's the truth. I'm seeing that you mastered yourself and somebody could be watching you. Heartbroken, feeling defeated, cause they were celebrating. Uh, a new relationship. Now that shit is being laid to rest. Hmm. So. Somebody thought they had you beat. Look like they're the ones that's beat. Now they be trying to be funny. But. Yeah. It look like somebody thought they had you beat. Hmm. What we got going on? Yeah, somebody envy you because you're beautiful. I'm saying that you are strong as fuck. Ignore the projections of doubt and fear. Because you can't fully trust them. Somebody is a karmic friend. And they will embarrass the fuck out of themselves. So don't say nothing. Because justice is coming. Until then, heal from trauma and drama. Yeah, because somebody is fake loyal. They want to be seen as perfect. But it's because of your money. And they're still in love with your ex. So somebody, what? 
Yeah, we got best friends turned lovers type love. Mm. So let's see what's going on. Why is envy you because you're beautiful? Yeah, king of wands. So you got a king of wands, Aries, Leo, or Sage. This is a bully who you could be in a relationship with or you could have like kids with. This motherfucker playing on juggling you. This is somebody that you gave nothing but love to. They feel like they'll get good news. But this is going to be a lesson learned. Okay? Just a lesson learned. Why is you are strong as fuck? Yeah, Page of Souls, you're strong as fuck. Because somebody thought that them slandering you, gossiping you, was going to, like, break you. I could be talking to a masculine. Somebody's in hella regret because they're getting karma for trying to get you ghosted. Yeah, they're being exposed for basically trying to break on you. This could be a Queen of Cups from your past. Yeah, you're single now. Or this could be an ex. Why is fake loyal? Wants to be seen as perfect. Yeah, eight of swords, sideways. This is somebody that's powerless. They don't know what to do. They mind fucking with them. One minute they feel free, the other minute they feel stuck. Again, it's an end of the cycle. Something has been laid to rest with this liar. Now the will is turning in your favor. There's a whole family under judgment for what they wish. But this is a lesson learned. Why is Kate fully trust them? Karmic friend will embarrass you in the drop of a dime. Yeah, this is somebody who wants what the fuck you have. And they're going to be exposed. You're being told to ghost this person so that the scales can be balanced. This person is crying over spilled milk because the king of pentacles was what? Talking shit about them? Gossiping about them? Somebody worked with a group of people to get you rejected, to cause a stalemate. And that's the fucking truth. This is somebody in your community. Why is justice is coming? Until then, heal from trauma. Yeah, eight of cups. Continue to walk away from people, places, and things that no longer serve you. How preachers in reverse. I'm saying that somebody is not listening to their intuition. This is why they're being blocked. This is somebody who wants to date you. They want to fight for you. But at the same time, they're in competition with you. This is why you need to let them go. Because all this plot and all this planning is just going to reveal the truth. That they got divided loyalty, and this is why you need to reject them. It's cool. Shit. Some motherfuckers is just good as friends. That's all. That's it. They want to be a level, but they can't live up to it. Yeah, you're being told to reject this person that you're in a connection with. You're dating somebody that you need to reject, that you need to let go. Yeah, whoever this person is that you're in a relationship with, they're going to want to apologize. They're going to want your forgiveness. They're going to feel guilty. They're going to want to come clean. Yeah, I'm saying that somebody is disappointed that they fell in a fucking trap. They thought they was going to gain some shit being smug. Now they're in danger. Yeah, somebody thought that, um, <laughs> oh, I guess we got to laugh at stuff like this. Like, somebody thought you was lonely. They thought they could make you their victim. They thought they was going to gain some shit, being arrogant. Now they're in danger. Why is loneliness here? Yeah, somebody could have tried to isolate you. This could definitely be your child's father, your father, your baby father. Yeah. Somebody tried to attack you to cause you heartbreak, Empress, and you still overcame this obstacle. <laughs> you still won. You still got victory and success. Why is trapped here? Yeah, somebody tried to allure you. Seven of Pentacles with some root work, page of cups, and you listen to your intuition or your dreams about how somebody tried to like in you and you had the strength to overcome it. Queen of Pentacles, man, you're healing. And somebody else is defeated. They got to lay that shit to rest because it's the end of this cycle. Why is gain here? Yeah, somebody thought they was going to cultivate off you. They thought they was going to gain some shit off you. High priestess. So, yeah, you gain. You could be a high priestess. You could be gaining from intuitive downloads. You could have your own platform. But you're overcoming some type of obstacle, empress. And somebody else is heartbroken because they tried to attack 
your masculine and did yeah it's like somebody worked with your masculine to attack you man and heartbroken empress because you overcame this obstacle by listening to your intuition and that's the fucking truth why is stubborn this here yeah somebody was being selfish and fucking arrogant yeah temperance you could be dealing with a sagittarius a virgo yeah somebody only wanted to reconcile with you to slow you up to sabotage you it was in competition with you and they did not want to give up until you dated them just so that they can block you you are being told to reject this person because they have divided loyalty and that's the truth they're a fucking liar so you need to walk away from whoever this person you're in a relationship with so that you can move on to common waters why is accident here yeah somebody's in danger yeah five of pentacles this could be a tourist like yourself well, this could be somebody that you left out in the cold. Nine of Pentacles. It's like you went from the Five of Pentacles to the Nine of Pentacles. Four of Pentacles. Only thing you need to do is hold back. You got a group of bitches here who took some type of action to play God in your life, to create some type of illusion so that they can defeat you, slander you, curse you, all because of this King of Wands in reverse. You're being told to listen to your intuition because you're going to overcome this obstacle, Empress, even though it's going to break your heart. Yeah, because somebody really attacked you that you was working with. You really thought this person was like your person. And now you're going to be like very sad to find out like <laughs> why they been getting karma. They've been getting karma because they've been attacking you. They're op. It's like they want to be seen as your person, but they're not. It's okay. I mean, hey. There's a lot of ops out here. But hey. It is what it is, Taurus. So that's all that I got for you. If the message resonates, make sure you like, share, subscribe.